are you? How are you? Thank you, my dear friends. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for watching my channel, Ivana Tero. This is daily tarot reading for all 12 zodiac signs for Thursday, December 13th, 2018. Okay, so let's see what type of story is in front of all of us. Oh, let me see, let me see. By the way, if you're for the very first time on my YouTube channel, welcome. And this is for men and for women, all 12 zodiac signs, daily prediction, daily type of, you know, energy. So let's try to see together what we can expect. Okay, and the very first tarot card is... Well, Ten of Pentacles, guys, this is about big money. This is about accomplishment. Mm, this is... I think this is a bonus of some kind. Getting, you know, something. Getting, like, something very tangible, you know. Ten of Pentacles always talks about money. Oh, maybe, maybe this is you making, you know, some plan how to spend, you know, some big money, you know. But probably this is coming, this is money which is coming your way. But for some of you, this could be like a big, you know, expense in front of you. Or maybe this is you talking with your partner you know, or with your family. Should we do such a thing, you know? Uh, should we pull, you know, this, this thing, you know? Maybe this is like special holiday for Christmas or, you know, whatever. Of course, you know, for some of you, this could be big inheritance coming your way. Could be. Ten of Pentacles is about wealth, big money, success, um, wisdom, what to do with money, how to invest money, uh, you know. Uh, and this tarot card always talks about know-how. You know, who knows? Maybe you will invent something. Maybe you know for sure that you are on a good track, you know, that soon you will earn like a big, you know, bucks. Also, Ten of Pentacles always talks about lasting uh, job, lasting job and big money. Okay, so remember what I told you. Let me see, guys. The next tarot card is Eight of Cups. Okay, so Eight of Cups is not very nice tarot card because Eight of Cups always talks about escapism, uh, Eight of Cups always, always, always talks about withdrawing yourself, you know, maybe you live in a golden cage, maybe you have a great, uh, uh, you know, great, a great deal of money already, maybe you want to avoid this type of um, uh, environment, maybe this is you saying, well, money is superficial, you know, I cannot stay in my marriage only because of money, because, you know, my soul needs something more. Guys, uh, listen, every single cups tarot card is always about your soul. So money can't buy you love. Money, only money cannot make you happy. Money can give you security. You can buy some stuff. Food you can pay, pay you, you know, bills. But Eight of Cups is saying money is not enough. My soul needs something else. My soul needs more affection, more love, you know. So you want to be surrounded, you know, with the people who are more like you. Also, those who tarot cards are saying, let's say you work as a nurse or as a doctor, you know, in some, you know, hospital. Uh, who knows, you know, you can meet. You know, someone who can fulfill your desire, uh, this this type of, you know, emotional, you know, desire, you know. Or maybe, who knows, you know, maybe you are going through some bad, you know, stuff because of, you know, big money issue, big money problem. So, don't try to escape, deal with it, you know. For some of you, this is you leaving your past, for some of you. And also, this could be, uh, those two tarot cards also basically are talking about that someone is missing you, someone is missing your support, someone is missing, uh, you know, safe harbor, because, you know, someone still think of you, you know, well, you know, I was like, you know, very, very stupid, and, you know, when I left, you know, this person, because, you know, this person was like, you know, the very best person in my life, not only because of money structure and security, uh, because this person, or maybe this is you guys, I don't know, you know, 
because let's say this is you, you know, so someone will make this type of, you know, decision, I was a fool, you know, what is going on, you know, give me a break, you know, okay, 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 stay, oh, gee, okay, please stay, so this is like, you know, someone uh, still kind of counts on you, but probably this is you leaving, you know, saying, well, money can't buy you love, you know, your time is up, this is probably your words, you know, your, your time is up, and, you know, I know I deserve something, you know, much more better, okay, oh, let me see, guys, what is the next tarot card, knight of swords, okay, you are ready to deal with the truth you are ready to say your peace and then you will you will make some change you know in this dynamic of of your love relationship but guys this also goes for your job you know maybe you will find out that maybe your boss have a plan to replace you you know and this is the saying okay give me my money you know for like for for the next three or six you know months and, you know, I'm leaving, you know, this shitty office, gladly. This also could be, not for all of you, but for some of you. So, Knight of Swords simply saying, you know, the time has come. The time has come. So, uh, this could be, this could be you willingly moving, you know, from some environment, bad relationship, bad friendship, bad, uh, bad, you know, um, job, you know, bad business deal even, bad business deal, or maybe this is you saying, no, I ain't gonna leave before I get my money, I ain't gonna leave, you know, but I will not leave, you know, before I get my cut, before I get my money, so you can count on that, you know, so also I can see very, 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 very strong energy of Capricorn, uh, Scorpio, Pisces, Libra and Gemini. So this is all about a very powerful uh, drama, um, even blackmailing, you know, if you leave me, you know, I will never give you my money. You cannot count on, you know, my legacy, you know, blah, 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 blah. And she will still leave, you know, saying, you know, saying to you or saying to someone else, blah, blah, whatever. You can't buy me. You can't buy me out, you know. I don't love you anymore. Your money means like nothing to me. I don't know. Maybe this is your story. Maybe it's not, you know. But sooner or later, you know, maybe who knows. Maybe this will become your story. Because I know every single story of mine plays out. Not for all of you guys, you know, because can you even imagine, guys, I never said that, uh, can you even imagine how many private messages every single day I receive, you know, from people all over the world saying, you know, how could even possibly you can know my own private, you know, story. So, guys, this is my job. I am a tarot reader. This is my job to know, okay? And the final tarot card is... Oh, 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 Ace of Cups. Evidence of love. Okay, finally. So this is you leaving one particularly bad situation. And at this precise moment, when you take your stuff, when you take your bag, your belongings, your, I don't know, whatever, at this precise moment, you will find out that someone is ready to do for you something big out of the blue. Maybe you will leave someone and almost at the exact same day you can meet love of your life. Or another scenario, when you really take all of your belongings, when you take your luggage, baggage, you know, whatever, you know, at that precise moment you will receive you know, a message Please don't leave me. Please don't. Either you will meet someone or either this person will cry in front of you, you know, begging you. Please, please stay. Please, 
don't leave me. Okay. So now let me see specific message for every single one of you. As usual, first, uh, Eris Leo said, Ah, I knew, I knew, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. She who runs with the wolves. Oh, so you must be very, 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 very strong woman. This is very strong woman, you know, when you are not afraid to say your piece, when you're not afraid to do what you feel that you need to do, when you're not afraid to start all over with the same person or maybe with someone else. Eris Leo Sech, let me read. She who runs with the wolves, fearless, bold, relentless, candid, independent, above all, independent woman. Men fear of you. Women fear of you, but everyone want to be like you. You are the ultimate woman, but takes a lot of courage to be with you. Although the reward is really, really big. But still, it takes a lot of courage and love to be with this type of uh, woman independent woman she's not afraid even to stay single to be single for quite a long time you know saying i don't care i don't have a problem you know being single you know i can wait maybe this is you so you know oh this is real love story okay now taurus virgo and capis let me see, guys, your message. Whoa, 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 whoa. Green hat. A sign of a manipulation. Someone is playing with you. And I don't like that, but I can't lie. So manipulation is possible. Things are not as they seem they are. Ask your question and ask twice. And then listen carefully. Listen carefully what this person will say to you. If this is someone, you know, playing, you know, tricks on you, obviously this is you saying, you know, honey, no tricks, no more, not with me. Okay. Terminates, Libras and Aquarians. Guys, you have a question on your mind. Question on your mind. A big one. What to do? How to know who is right or who is wrong? Does he even loves me? Or she? Or he? Or she? Or he? He, she, she, he, he, she, she, he. Never mind. Regardless of gender, big, 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 big question is on your mind. Like, you know, what to do? Does he or she loves me? Or maybe not, you know, because guys, don't forget the final tarot card is Ace of Cups. So this is, you know, admitting, you know, I love you. So obviously this person have a problem admitting this type of, you know, um, thing, uh, admitting, you know, that he loves. And this is someone who is ready to fight for you, even to fight for you. But only when you say, okay, I'm gone, you know, and only then. He will decide to keep you. So this is not about you. This is about them. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Road. Hit the road, Jack. And never look back. No, 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 no. Or whatever, no? Okay. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. You are so ready to hit the road. So, Jack, wait no more. If you are that unhappy, like really unhappy, Guys, the road, meaning road or new opportunity, is in front of you. So if you're like 100% sure that you are ready, you know, to move, to find like a new place, you know, for your life or whatever, you know, guys, don't wait. So final advice and, you know, quantum tarot reading behind the reading. You really need to be very, very strong, you know, regardless of your gender. 
Maybe someone is manipulating you. Maybe someone is playing tricks, you know, with your mind. And of course, you know, when someone is very skilled in manipulation, you know, you do not know. I, you know, is this really, you know, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I heard that altogether wrong, you know. Yes, no, yes, no. People who are skilled in manipulation, they are truthful ma magicians. You can't know either for real or maybe they are playing, you know, tricks of, you know, some kind in front of your healthy eyes. And this is why we have this, you know, big question mark, because you still do not know. I mean, is this for real? You know, is this truth or a lie? So, if you think that someone is playing or lying to you, honey, hit the road, Jack. And, you know, wait no more. But if you think that there is still love, then, honey, wait no more. Go back and, you know, kiss this person and simply talk it through. Okay? Okay. So, this is our daily tarot reading. What can I say, guys? You know, life is tricky business. Very, 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 very tricky business, you know. And almost every single day, you know, we doubt in ourselves, you know. So put your comments, you know, down below and simply say, you know, when you are in a doubt, do you believe more in you or in your partner? Guys, I wish you all the best from the bottom of my heart. And thank you so very much for your comments. Believe it or not, I still read every single one of them call me book a private reading with me if you need me if you want to talk with me you will get tarot reading and astrology for the price of one make sure to subscribe on my channel like and share this video with your friends god bless you all